everyone, welcome to Headlines of the Day. This is 30th of April 2022 and we are back again with some of the major articles from the Indian Express. Let's begin our today's discussion with the very first article on page number one from GS2 International Relations. The article is headlined as Keen on good ties with Pakistan but it must end terror. Bids to draw global attention to Jammu and Kashmir, says General Narvane. From this article, you have to consider what is the present status of bilateral relations between India and Pakistan, the border issues, various deals and agreements, and what more needs to be done to strengthen the relations. Moving further on page number one itself from GS3 Economy section, there's an article that talks about the power shortage and Railways has cancelled 753 trips to prioritize the coal delivery. So this is basically about the coal shortage. And from this article, you have to understand how low are the coal stocks signaling a power crisis, its repercussions and government steps in this particular context. Moving further on page number five from GS2 International Relations, there's an article that, that talks about S. Jay Shankar's visit to Bhutan. Our bond is emotional, built on concern for each other, says Mr. S. Jay Shankar. From this article, you have to understand the latest developments regarding Indo-Bhutan relations and their importance. Moving further on page number seven from GS2 International Relations is another article. Continuing to engage in positive atmosphere, it will resolve differences, says General Narvane. From this article, you have to understand what are the main challenges faced by General Narvane throughout his tenure, the progress of talks on the remaining friction factors and what is the possible scenario ahead. Moving further on page number 8 from GS2, Polity and Governance, there's another article, Rules for the IAS. Now, this article is about IAS officer Shah Faisal, who resigned in 2019, has been reinstated by the central government. From this article, you have to understand what rules apply when an IS officer resign and what rules govern these actions. All right, moving further on page number 11 from GS3 Economy section, there's an editorial article that talks about, so the article is headlined as Blueprint for Semicon Diplomacy. India could become alternative destination for semiconductor manufacturing. From this article, you have to understand what is a semiconductor and why is there a shortage, the relevance of global cooperation, how these semiconductor chips are the drivers for ICT development, significance of placing sem semicon diplomacy at the heart of India's foreign policy, how pivotal is it for India's at ease policy, India's drive for self-sufficiency in the semiconductors. Moving further on page number 13 from GS3 economy section. From page number 13, GS3 economy section, this article talks about an RBI report that was released recently that says economy to take till 2035 to overcome the COVID losses. From this article, you have to understand what are the key takeaways from the RBI's report on currency and finance in 2021-22. All right, moving further on page number 13 from GS2 International Relations, there's another article that talks about the India-European Union Free Trade Agreement. So the article is headlined as India-EU to hold talks on FTA in June, set 2023-2024 target. From this article, you have to understand what is the significance of India-EU upcoming talks on FTA and another agreement signed recently with other countries. All right, moving further on page number 13 from GS2 Polity and Governance, there's another article, Need to Update the IT Act. No privacy concern in the CERT guidelines, says Mr. Ashwini Vaishnav. From this article, you have to understand what are the key features of the Information Technology Act 2000, its significance, why is there a need for amendments and what is the possible scenario ahead. So with this, we call it a wrap of today's edition of Headlines of the Day, the Indian Express. We'll see you with more such videos in the upcoming future. Till then, take care and do stay tuned. Oh,